Just Jane NX611 hasn't had her tail off the ground in more than 30 years and today was her big day. More than 100 people were dotted around the East Kirkby airfield waiting to see whether the pilot could take her to the point of takeoff and bring her safely back again. And he did, again and again, stirring up emotions in those who watched. I did my complete tour from here and why I came over today was twofold. One is that I've never seen a Lancaster move on this airfield for 56, 7 years ago. So it was a nostalgic, eerie occasion for me to be back at my own base uh, after all these years. I just thought, wow. <laughs> I, I mean, I'm quite, I'm interested by all planes, but especially World War II aircraft, aircraft like the Spitfire and the Lancaster. But no one was more excited than the Lancaster's owners. Well, it is another step near, isn't it? You know, to see it go down, down the runway after 31 years, uh, the tail end off the ground, so it's another step near to, uh, to the goal if you, to get it airborne, if we go as far as that. Just Jane is playing a central role in Night and Day, a new BBC drama based on the experiences of those who flew the Lancasters during the war. That runway isn't used by the museum, it's the first time it's been used by the museum and the plane. Um, so it's thrilling to see it all, it all come together, it's thrilling to see that we could get it to work at speed and to get the tail in the air. Um, yeah, no, we didn't, uh, we didn't know we could do it, but we did. The Lancaster's performance during the war was second to none, and it's more than likely that she'll be stealing the show once again when night and day is screened in the autumn. Vicky Johnson, BBC Look North, East Kirkby.